Hey guys, Mechanic CG here and welcome back to another episode of Forza Motorsport. Today is episode number 60. If you guys do enjoy the video, make sure to leave a like, comment down below and subscribe, and let's get into the content. This video was streamed live on Twitch. Come watch us live with the link in the description. Okay, well, top of the morning to everyone here. Uh, we're starting off with the European RP1 Open. Uh, if we win this, we get the Audi number one Infineon R8. We've got nine races to do. Starting off with Alpine Ring, Laguna Seca, Road Atlanta, Sunset Peninsula Infield, New York, Maple Valley, Silverstone, Road America, and finishing off with Rio de Janeiro. Let's get cracking. Okay, so the car that I've picked is starting in fifth. A uh, little bit concerning. But hopefully we can get a good start. Okay, yeah. It's not doing too bad, actually. Yo, Pandy, what up? Yes, this is the Porsche Stratton version. Oh, well, technically it's not because the Stratton version is basically this car, but not the race model. Hence why it's called street version. Yeah, this is just the GT1. Do, 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 do. Vodoleo. Holy crap. There we go. Don't forget, keep the chat in English. I understand you like Swedish banter, but we got to keep the chat in English. Do 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 do. Bodoleo. That Audi is going to be on my ass this entire championship. Yes, watch this Pillock driver push. Yeah, we're not getting a new power supply. Uh, plans have changed. It just still says it on there. I love you. There's no way to break you. I'm staying in the house every weekend. 
Yo, Rav, what up? How you doing, man? How you been? Hopefully you're doing good. I am also doing amazing, by the way. Thank you very much for asking. Right, so that Audi is losing a substantial amount of time through that chicane section. House every weekend, house every weekend, house every weekend, how house every weekend. House every weekend, house every weekend, how house every weekend. Oh yeah, we've had quite a bit of rain the past few days. We had a two-day thunderstorm where I live. I think three, three or four days ago. Which is crazy. Let myself go. So the Bentley and the Audi are fighting behind, which is good because they're going to slow each other down. I love you. There's no means to break it. Staying in the house every weekend. Let you see temps through the weekend and today it's cold and rainy. Jesus Christ. I hate it when it's like warm and then the temperature suddenly gets cold. Like I don't mind the gradual adjustment. To temperatures in the UK, but the UK, we have days where it's like a cool 15 degrees, which is like, okay, maybe 20. And then the next day it's 28. It's hanging in your house every weekend. No worries, Pandy. Ever thought of doing some eye racing? I would love to do eye racing, but problem is I've. I'm not going to bother starting paying for it until my wheel's working. My wheel's fucked. Well, my wheel's fine. It's my PC that's fucked. I'm actually going to um, plug it into my Xbox tomorrow. i got to remind myself to plug it into my Xbox tomorrow. To see if it boots up and works. Because if it boots up and works on my Xbox, then it's not the wheel. It's something wrong with... The drivers. Yeah, get a new one. With what money? <laughs> Genuinely got no money for a wheel. Because I'm not buying a new Logitech. Because they're shit. Not buying a Thrustmaster. Because they're shit. I'd be buying myself a Fanatec or something. And that's going to cost like 800 quid. That's extremely annoying. Absolutely ruined that. Yeah, so the wheel is fine. It should be fine. I've obviously got to test it tomorrow. Right, we're on hard mode now. I want to get the um, Fanatec CSL DD Pro. The one for um, uh, the CSL, DD, Gran Turismo, whatever it's called. 
the Gran Turismo wheel for the PlayStation and the PC. Get out of the way. All right, we've got one more card to take down. I think it was there that I was losing a substantial amount of time, to be honest. We've got two laps to do this, so... Don't need to slow down that much, mate. Uh, it's a Fanatec CSL DD for the Gran Turismo 1 for PS5 and PC. That's what I'm going to be looking at. We just about got away with that cock up. But holy crap, I do not want to do that again. Class, that is done. Save a replay. And we'll move on and forget anything ever happened. Okay, attempt number two. Agreed. If you buy a 3090, then I think it's just a status symbol at the end of the day. It's just like, oh, look, I've got a better card than you. But really, when you think about it, the only two cards you really ever want to think about getting are the two lower end cards of the 30, the 30 series, 3060 or the 3070. Horrendous. Yeah, Laguna Seca, worst track in this game. Worst track ever, let's be honest. I like to categorize tracks as fun tracks, like good fun tracks, mediocre tracks, ones that you can put up with, and shit tracks. This is in the shit tracks category. No, I hate it. It's such a poor track design. Sure, it's fun to whip a car around and drift around the track. It's a cool drift track. Not very good for racing.
It doesn't allow for close racing. Oh, I fucking hate this track so much. Yeah, Beamer, that's what you get for getting up my ass. Do you know what the funny thing is? This game's on easy mode right now. I'm playing this on the easiest difficulty. Like, I'm gonna be honest. I I think there's some artificial difficulty modifications in this game as you get to the higher end stuff. Because there's no way that these enemy cars are this fast. I had to turn it down to easy because otherwise I would never finish the game. I'm not even that shit. <laughs> Paddy, you know I'm not shit. I whoop your ass in Gran Turismo every time. The only way you've won is by crashing into me. <laughs> Plus, this game's handling model is pretty shit. Even then, you don't need to be a... Well, yeah. Not an FPS gamer, though. I prefer my story games. Ah, uh, your mum's got her piece. That's good enough. Right, we gained a place because the AI absolutely fucked up. I was like, how on earth did the AI overtake the Bentley? Then I realised it shouldn't have. I may not do all these races today. I may only do six or seven. I really cannot read chat at the moment. Ah, uh, corkscrews clapped. Honestly, just the handling model of these cars in this game are horrendous. Fucking hell. Oh, 
bomb. Bomb. Got it. What do you think of Bran Flakes? Bran. I did say I'm struggling to read chat, so just bear with. I really don't give two shits about the Pope, to be honest. Or anything like that. It's just fucking shit that I don't really bother about. Did you overshoot the... Ah, oh, this game is clapped. I'm going to see if I can swap the card during a championship. I doubt it, but who cares? Because this Porsche is not doing it justice. Clearly, that Bentley is much faster. Oh, what the fuck? Get back here. Oh, fucking hell. Fuck! Holy shit. Fuck! Come on, we got this. Got it. Every time I hear this groove. 
Makes me wanna move. Must be the feeling it brings to you. Please crash. That's all I ask. Please crash. Not me, but them. I said not me, you prick! Fuck! Ah. Oh. Ah. Oh. It's so extremely weird how varied these cars seem to be performing on these tracks. It's why I'm certain that uh, Turn 10 actually programmed deliberately to make certain cars more powerful on certain tracks to make it a lot more challenging. And I think that's why <laughs> this is one of the worst rated Forzas, just because of that fact. What's her standings like? 15 points. Okay. We're going to swap cars. Okay, here we go. Road Atlanta. I've swapped cars. I'm not driving that shitbox again. Porsche equals poop. We're taking the big Bunda Bentley. Oi, right, get away. Cheers for pushing me in to the middle of nowhere. Oh, the AI cars drive me mad. Joe, I can't wait to finish this and not play Forza for a week. Until I then have to go through the pain of mo Motorsport 2. Motorsport 3 and Motorsport 4 and the other Motorsports aren't a pain. It's just the first two are a bitch. Gone on a train together for a long, long ride. Have you managed that there, Mr. Beamer? You're going to push me off? Okay, you're going to push me off the track. Yeah, you stay in there. Yeah, my corner. You realize while you're spamming questions, I'm not going to answer a single one because I don't have enough time to read it. So I'm just going to ignore it until it slows down. <laughs> Train sped along the tracks. We knew there was no way we could ever turn back. Is this what love means? Is this what love means? Is this what love means? Unbelievable. A such a bad joke.
Do you know what, Aaron? I'm taking you to court. It's going to be like Johnny Depp versus Amber Heard. It's going to be DH Aaron versus Mechanic CG. Taking you to court uh, and suing you for uh, emotional damages with your shitty joke. <laughs> No, 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 no. Better get yourself a lawyer, boy. <laughs> Whisper to you. Is this what love means? It's what love means. I mean, technically speaking, you probably can't be the judge. Banana now 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 banana now 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 Benam 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 I'm actually curious to see because uh, apparently the Johnny Depp versus Amber Heard trials are actually in its sixth week now. Which is kind of crazy to think about that it's been going on for that long. Which uh, also means. We could see um, a verdict fairly soon. Yo, Sinsu, welcome. How you doing, my man? I mean, sure, but Wolfie can't be the judge. He can't be part of the jury either. Neither can Pandy. Fair enough, Sinsu. I'm uh, taking someone to court today. Because <laughs> why not? Suing for emotional damages over a really shitty joke. <laughs> Yay! My headphones are about to die. Great, another set. Show me the socks. I want to see the hentai socks.
Come on. You can have Wolfie as your lawyer. I'll have uh, Pandy as my lawyer. <laughs> Off with your head. Dance, dance, dance till you're dead. Right, so what we'll do, we'll do this race in the next one and then I'm going to end the stream there. Burn up, Schmidt, brown, 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 brown. <laughs> Sinsu, um, do 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 do. You know our deal that we had, where uh, you would buy two copies of. Test drive Solar Crown, and I buy two copies of Need for Speed. Uh, I assume that deal's still on, correct? Just delayed. Bidum, bidum. My headphone finna about to die, and I gotta get this done as soon as possible. I gotta get this done uh, very fucking quick, otherwise my headphone will die, and I won't have any audio. Audio. I won't have any audio, audio. I won't have any audio, audio. And a one and a two. Mate, you're, you're building us a case. You're giving us more fuel for the fire. Aaron, you're incriminating yourself right now with these really bad puns. Bed inwards. Ow. Technically, though, it wouldn't be accidental if you were wishing for him to do it. Because then there would be some form of deliberate act. So. Dun dun dun. Innocence. You'll never. Be mine, 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 mine. There we go, across the finish line. 11.48. <laughs> you think too hard, just have it as a threat. That's proper hardcore northerner. A proper scouser. Time for another race. Uh, because I have food downstairs. So I would like to eat. Preferably. Is that alright with you? Sometimes I do end before 10.30. Hmm? Speedy man, Majin! You need it on stream. No, because I've got to cook it. Like, I've got to reheat it and cook it properly and all that shit. Basically, we got a takeaway. Or, Nan got a takeaway. When she went out. Didn't eat it all. I'm having the leftovers. Well, it's like a full-on fucking meal, so. Poggers.
I'm fucking starving, mate. This is where you're supposed to drive on this track. I can't believe how sticky the car is. No. You're not getting a cooking stream. Because if I do a cooking stream, I'll accidentally burn down the house. Maybe. Who knows? <laughs> Imagine setting off a fire alarm making a cheese toasty. Couldn't be me. Pandy, are you really admitting that your cooking is that bad that a cheese toasty nearly set off your fire alarm? Because if so, you might want to retire. Like now. Oh, current song says Tidal. That's not correct. So the way that my current song thing is working um, is um, before we used uh, integration that used a web-based thing. But the thing is the latency was anywhere from 10 seconds to three minutes to update and I actually put up what the song was and sometimes when a new song started the last song would be announced as oh it's now playing so what I've now done is I've got a custom bit of software um, and it is so simple basically what it does is it reads what the title of the music player is says um, like the music player application Reads what it says, and then puts it in the text document so you can pull it into OBS. It is so simple. Meow, meow. Meow, meow. Innocence. Meow, meow. Not bad. Frying pan. Pan of frying. Oh my god, what a corner.
No, we were doing so well. The FBI says, please. FBI, open up. Shit. Come on, we got this. Two more laps. Not bad. So yeah, we only got three videos done today, which is not ideal. In four hours. Three videos are not good. But, hopefully, tomorrow we'll get... Uh, one, two, three, four done. Yeah, we need... Four videos done tomorrow. Final lap. Spell check. Oh my god, that's unbelievable. Random fact, I have tickets to Formula E in London this summer. Ooh! Fancy! Shit! I don't mind Formula E. It looks awesome. And honestly, the racing is some of the coolest looking racing out there. It's just the noise of the cars. I just can't get over it. It's the only thing that brings Formula E down. Everything else about it is fucking amazing. If I'm gonna be honest. There's the noise of the cars. I miss the of the cars. But yeah. It is what it is. Not bad. 1041. 104. I'll take it. We'll finish the stream. Come back tomorrow. Save and quit. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you did enjoy, be sure to leave a like, comment down below and subscribe, and I will see you in the next one. Peace out.